This is the easiest breeze farm in Minecraft. Once the spawn is activated, the breezes will land on top of the hoppers. You will be standing inside the composter, hitting the breezes with your sword. All items will go into the hopper and then into the chest. And this is the materials needed for the tutorial. The area needed for this tutorial is a 6x5. So once you've got your 5x5 five five area marked out and your spawners in the center, break this block here and add a double chest. Then follow on from that, break these three blocks behind it and add three hoppers. Add a trap door here and activate it. And the same with this side here. Behind this trap door, you wanna add a composter. Once you've done that, add a too high wall going around the farm. Place a trap door just above the composter and it's a free block gap just behind the spawner and you wanna just fill that in. And then you wanna put a row of blocks on top of the spawner. Underneath, add a redstone torch right next to the trap door. Add a roof on top so none of the breezes can get out and the farm should look something like this. To stop the breezes activating this trap door, you wanna break this block here and add a redstone torch. To activate this farm, just get inside the composter, activate this trap door. To start the farm, all you need to do is sit here and wait for the breezes to spawn. All their loot will go into the hoppers, into the chest. I would recommend getting a sharpness enchantment along with a fire aspect one too. When the spawner turns off like this, it's on a 30 minute cooldown. So a little information about the anonymous bottle. So basically, if you drink that potion and you go into the trial chambers, the spawner mobs will come out with better armor if they're already wearing armor. If they're not wearing armor, they will double in quantity. Well, that's what I read anyways. After 30 minutes, this spawner will reactivate and start by itself if you're nearby. To get the bad omen portion, you can go into the trial vaults. Killing the breezes actually drops some of these trial keys, which is used to unlock the vaults. And that is pretty much it for this tutorial. If you did enjoy this tutorial, be sure to smash that like button and subscribe for more tutorials like this in the future. And I'll see you in the next one. Peace.